So we're back on the gondola, which means we're back riding downhill. Yes, we are. How are we feeling, Nico? Excited. Excited? <laughs> yeah. How are you feeling, Dad? Yeah, good. <laughs> Everyone's feeling good. Weather is still looking okay so far. Should be a dry race this time. And uh, yes, we're just going up for a track walk now. So uh, it will be exciting to see what they build for us this year. They changed the jumps a bit at the bottom. Um, so um, exciting. So we barely made it in time for the gondola. The lady was not happy with us being too late. But we're back to it. Slowest gondola day is probably. And back to the top, so we made it. So out of the slowest lift probably in the world. But we made it to it, so that's nice. The lady was nice enough to let us go on to it. Um, so that was cool. Um, she was almost as chill as this guy, to be honest. That's probably the most chill gondola guy I've ever seen. Wearing sunglasses, look at how sunny it is. <laughs> <laughs> how cool. But uh, he, he, was was he was happy, so we are happy. And uh, yes, now we're at the top, so uh, let's see what the Leger has in store for us for this year. So here we are then, we got a new rollout and we got some grip on it too, perfect, thumbs up. <laughs> so they built two big berms over here, but apparently we won't use them, we'll just straighten them up and then going off of this drop, and it's probably the highest speed section other than the beer all the way at the bottom, but looks pretty fresh now and we had a lot of rain last week so conditions actually should be quite good although it will will dig in super quick so the track will be quite rough quite quick i would say so here we are just coming into the woods now looks like we got sick jumps sick jumps in it as nico said speed and style pretty good jump to be honest they did did some proper work to it, so that's cool to see. It used to always go here and then between the trees and then into that little forest bit, but now it's all fresh. So that's very sick. Infamous J Road Gap. Not so infamous anymore. It's much easier than it used to be. It used to go just right there in the corner. Now it's just straight drop. Really yes, I think some people got scared over time. But we were the real the real guys doing the old track still. Yes. So we're out of the first bit of the track, just crossed the fire road. And now we're heading into one of the old 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 school bit of the track that we had a couple of years already. My line was always to go just wide around the trees. Doesn't really look like they changed much other than they take away that stump. So we'll have to have a look on that. But so far, looks super cool. I didn't film anything at the top, but every, every, like a lot of the stuff at the top, it's brand new. Like they taped it super good. So shout out to the guys who did that because that looks absolutely sick. We are well keen so far on the track. So another part which is new for me, but looks like it's the same as last year's. Bit of a chicane now. Last last time I raced, it was more to that side, and then you're coming straight onto like I don't know if this is a jump line or not, but we're going straight. Oh yeah, we're going on the jump line, but we reverse it. We go up the jump line for a bit. That's funny. But the dirt right now is quite wet still, so it might be uh, spicy still for tomorrow. Um, so it'll be it'll be interesting. Hopefully, I don't fall down here because it looks pretty steep to me. I already fell once, I don't want to fall again. Okay, we made it. So the French ants are not gonna be stoked with this. Look how big of a house they built. This is all the ant nests. Look. And the house is gonna be destroyed after practice for sure. Poor ants. Definitely. <laughs> 
So it's a bit of a challenge just to walk down the track. Oh. Nico is taking the high line. But I survived. I'm taking the low line. Yes, I survived too. But I fell earlier, so. But it's definitely like super clay out, out here. But it's... It'll be, it'll be interesting to see tomorrow with how much grip you actually will have, so that'll be interesting for sure. So we made it down two-thirds of the track, I would say. So, DJ Paul, what are we saying? It looks good. What, do you, what, what does the mechanic say? As a, a little bit slippery. A little bit slippery. And tire choice? What do, you, what do you say as a mechanic? I maybe cut a dirt dance. Okay, the man says it, cut dirty dance. Well, uh, we'll have a look tomorrow and see, but uh, I'm kind of on the same same train, to be honest, at least on the front. So, making our way down now, last bit of the track. This, is, this has been here for quite a long time. Um, the only problem is because it's been here for a long time, all the roots came out. So, before you could do like a low line up here, or you do a full high line, but now the low line is kind of destroyed and then the high line is, is kind of mad mad too because all the roots came out. So when you jump, you're basically landing on these roots right here and then trying to survive over that big one right there. But maybe if it dries up and some ruts dig in, it should actually be okay. This is the look from the other side that makes more sense. So there's even a line to come down here, which would be interesting. So I'm just taking a picture of that real quick. So I got the picture um, in case that would be a line too. Down here would definitely not be the go. And then looks like it's quite off camber down here. So probably want to stay as high as possible right there to not like brat on it and then straight on afterwards so still getting still quite wet in the woods which uh, is quite interesting because uh, I actually expected it to be much better it was plenty we rode in plenty the other day and it was it was it was wet but it was not like clay like this but I reckon because it's so fresh and people just walk it um, it just gets a bit destroyed and it'll end up looking like like this um, but but yeah like you're just like slipping down here so quite interesting don't slip away it's a goal that's the goal don't slip away um, that's the very good tip from hopefully you. we don't need to be careful to slip away because it will be dry that's yeah. our goal we see we wait tomorrow when we wake up at eight o'clock because we're in a practice which is nice and then we look outside and if it's sunny we'll be happy and if it's not we know it's going to be wet so uh yeah interesting this is the this is the bum so we're making it down to the last bit of the track making it super steep again with a fresh 90 corner made by the man himself shay hayton unfortunately he made it only yesterday i think or they rebuilt it yesterday so it's super soft, so I'm quite scared. Um, it'll be destroyed even when we already go down here, down, down for our practice, but. I would like to be the first one going into the turn. That would be. That would be a good one. Yeah, that would be a good one. So we reckon just go wide, make a super high line on the grass and then strain it up. Because I reckon that corner will be destroyed. Because if you're coming from down here, over here, it'll be quite a big impact in the corner. Okay then, making it down to the finish arena. Track walk done. Good track, good, good fun. Good try, good fun. Track looks pretty sick. They changed the last berm as well, so we don't come in flying and do the same. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, that was folly, yeah. Like, but it wasn't her fault though, because it, the corner was just, the entry was just a bit shite. But now they made it perfect, so we're stoked. They did a co cool bit of taping. Last bit is a bit same, same as always, but they can't really do too much. Um, the traverse over the grass field. But yeah, 
should be good. Tomorrow's practice day, so we're waiting out the weather a bit for the tire choice and stuff. But I reckon we'll make a wheel ready with the maybe Magic Marys and then one with the Dirty Dance, and then we can swap around depending on the weather. So, yeah, should be good. Thanks for watching, and um, we'll uh, keep you guys updated on the, on the videos. And uh, yeah, probably next video will be from race day, so uh, or quality day. So we'll see what happens. Thanks again, and adios.